I have been surprised since I started being public and, you know, mentioning and bringing up what I've been learning in Messianic Judaism uh, to have some Christians come to me and say, are you, do I read right that uh, baptism is in fact a Jewish uh, ritual and a, a, a Jewish practice and not a Christian one? I said, you read it right. It's been around a lot longer than you think it has. So, first of all, um, who invented this and why do we think it started with John the Baptist? John sure. the Baptist, that wasn't his name. His surname wasn't the Baptist. Yeah. Um, he was John. He was actually a Levite. Right. Anyway, right. I don't want to go into that too much into that. But baptism is a rite that isn't even Jewish. It precedes even Judaism. Baptism has been around for as long as culture has been aware of religion. For as long as people have understood that water is a source of life, yeah. which takes us... That takes us right back to the beginning of of humanity's civilization, effectively. It's not unique even just to Judaism in that way. So yeah. cultures before that would have done it. But the logic behind it is quite obvious. The logic is that baptism is a form of cleansing. It's mystical. Water is mystical. Mm. The nature of what water can do, what it does for life it can give life and it takes life yeah it so you got all of that so there's there's all of that in it and judaism just is a very practical culture that's we are a teaching civilization so everything becomes a practical component of how this works if you think about jesus words you have to be born of water and of the spirit so some people reckon oh you have to be baptized and then get the spirit and i'm like no wait think about that slowly when you are born physically, what are you laying in for nine months? Water. You're laying in water. So you're born of water. I was born once in water, and when I get born again, and this was a term used for Gentiles. The irony is, Paul, the concept of being born again wasn't used for Jews. It was actually used for Gentiles that converted to Judaism. Mm, yeah, the, the, the con yeah, right. Isn't that ironic? That the concept of being born again would lean more to Gentiles that say, well, I was born, but I want a new identity and I'm choosing it within Judaism. Mm. 